Construction is a process. In this series, we are going to take you through the project. A 420 meter squared marshonette boasting of five bedrooms, all in suit, spacious living areas, a spacious landscaped garden, and a rooftop terrace for recreational functions. On day one, we started off by excavating and removing the black cotton soil. At this point, the site was ready for construction to start. What soil type is covering your land? Drop your answer in the comment section. Accurate setting out ensures the building is level and helps prevent costly errors. The setting out was done as per the architectural and structural drawings. Remember, precision is important in the entire construction process. These are some of the construction materials we are using for our project. While excavating, we encountered rock two feet below the existing ground level. This was helpful. We are sure our building is laying on stable ground. Blinding is then done. This is a layer of concrete placed on the ground that serves as a stable flat surface for the strip footing and column bases reinforcement for foundation walling.
Why build a flat-roofed house? One, it's cost-effective. And two, it provides extra space for various functions. For example, a garden or a recreational area. After completing the foundation walling on day 6, we started backfilling using non-expansive backfill material. Make sure you watch this video to the end, and if you're here for the first time, consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up. On day 8, we started compacting the hard core in layers. The importance of compaction is to provide greater bearing. Constructing a foundation that will stand the test of time is important when building. On day 10, we started hand packing. If you're here for the first time, consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up. BPM and BRC are properly laid before the casting of the ground floor slab. Vibrating concrete using a poker vibrator helps remove the air pockets. This increases the density and strength of the concrete. During casting, the cement, sand, and ballast ratio are very important to maintain the concrete strength.
If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Thank you.